Hello and welcome to the desk of Fusta 2005. I know it's been a while since my last video. Uh, as many of you may remember, I, uh, I do not do videos unless I personally buy the items that I am uh, unboxing and reviewing. So sometimes there can be quite the distance between, uh, between videos. Uh, today we are going to be looking at the brand new this came out on April 30th, Apple AirTag. I'm going to be unboxing it and setting it up on my phone. I just got the uh, the single one. You can the, you can pick these up for about $30. Uh, you can also get the, the four pack, which is $100. So you save, save a little bit of money, uh, about $20 overall, uh, if you get the four pack. But uh, I don't know what I'm going to think about these. I'll have to uh, do a review of these later on. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, open this sucker up. Pretty simple, pretty simple packaging. Not much, not much in the box. Just the uh, the holder here. We got some uh, documentation. Who knows what these are? No, no, no stickers, unfortunately, in this one. So these are just. Uh, random information. Anyway, so here we go. There we go. It's uh, just a single little disc. I, uh, I don't have the uh, a comparison, but uh, oh, I would say the metal part itself here is about the size of a quarter. And the, the white part is much thicker than a quarter, but um, yeah, so you won't be putting this into a wallet or anything. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and take the the wrapping off here. I don't want to. Whoops. Pretty hard to hang on to, actually. Take the outer covering. I don't want to pull that yet, because that's the battery. Uh, so, yeah, it's pretty shiny now. You can see my fan up on the ceiling. You can see my face. Do a little wave. Um, it's pretty nice looking now, but uh, from what I understand, the uh, the metal on this is pretty... Um, pretty... What's the word I'm looking for? Susceptible to scratches. So, uh, if you're going to put this somewhere and you want to make it look... you want to keep it nice, I put it in a, one of those nifty cases they've come out with. Uh, I w wouldn't recommend the Apple ones. There are plenty of cheaper, cheaper options out there as far as the holders for these. And, um, you know, the direct competitor to this is uh, the tiles. And they do have a way to, to hold on to them with a hole in it. But um, otherwise, you know, they're pretty much the same thing. Um, I hear that Tile is coming out with a new one to uh, help out with the stuff that this one does that Tile does not. Especially in regards to the number of people that can find these. So, I don't, if you guys haven't caught up with the, uh, the times, Basically, this helps you find an item that you put it on, be it a, a purse, a bag, luggage, uh, keys, um, etc., etc. Pretty much anything you want. It does have some safety features, um, such as you know, if you have an AirTag near you that's not yours, it, it will alert you. If you have an iPhone, of course. If you have an Android. I'm not sure if 
it will do that for you. I'll have to check on that. But uh, I know if you have an Apple device and you have, if somebody's trying to track you, um, it will alert you. Don't know a whole lot about everything that they put in here for safety features. But it's a pretty simple device. I mean, there's not much to, to look at. You can actually get, um, you can actually put uh, letters and uh, emojis on here, laser etched, if you get the Apple, if you buy it from the Apple website. I bought this one in particular from Best Buy because I have points. So, uh, I just did did it that way. I just bought the single pack, of course. And, yeah, so, you know, just touching it here, uh, you can get a lot, you have fingerprints on it. Uh, but it is a really good design. You can see here that it says Ultra Wideband, AirTag, designed by Apple in California, standard stuff, assembled in China. And uh, has Bluetooth uh, LE on it. So the, the, the Bluetooth uh, low energy and ultra wideband is what they use uh, to locate these things. Basically, it does not have a GPS uh, system in it. It um, uses uh, the Bluetooth and uh, NFC, basically, which is the, the wide, wide band to let you know that your device has been found in a certain area, say you leave your keys in the park or something like that, and you know, you're not near it anymore, so your phone can't detect it, but uh, you know, somebody else who has an iPhone walks by and it, and it picks it up, and then it'll use their GPS unit without giving them giving out their personal information and it'll say hey somebody walked by your device and or walked by your air tag and this is the general area it's in and then you go and look for it so with without rambling further and further on I think you guys get the general idea so let's go ahead and set this up and see if we can uh, see how how it looks here so as you can tell I, I haven't pulled out the the, the plastic here because it's actually uh, connected to the uh, the connection to the battery inside so I didn't want to activate it right away but it says it's pretty easy to activate so let's go ahead and you hear right away that uh, it pops up and you saw right there that it pops up on my phone uh, I came up with a chime and all I have to do is say connect and then you can uh, you know pick whatever I want um, I don't have any things really I thought I might try to put it in my wallet but it's pretty thick um, you know if they made a card sized one or at least you know, two card, two credit cards thick or something, then maybe it would work. You can you can do a custom name here. It's like wallet, umbrella. It gives you some general idea of what they want you to use it on. Luggage, keys, jackets, headphones, handbag, uh, camera, bikes, and a backpack. They they do make some accessories. Other companies make some accessories that will, uh, you know, help it be on a bike. I, I personally probably wouldn't put it somewhere that you could see it uh, simply because you know everybody's going to know that it's an Apple AirTag and uh, they're gonna either take the battery out and and you know crush it or you know throw it somewhere else take it off so I would personally put it somewhere that's inconspicuous but uh, let's go ahead and say that I want to put this on my keys. Yep, I want to use this iPhone. 
we're going to blur out the information here. And then it takes a few seconds to set it up. Gives you another chime. And there you go. And we're going to blur this out as well. So uh, you can't figure out where I live. And then we're basically done. That's it. Now, the cool thing is about this is that you can actually replace the battery. So you basically push down and twist it. And it has a, uh, this particular one is a Panasonic CR2032 battery. They are fairly easy to uh, come by. Um, you know, they're a general watch battery. So, so basically you put it back on and it uh, goes, goes on pretty quick, easy. This is really the only Apple product that you can uh, change your own battery in. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much it, uh, unboxing. Uh, you know, it gives you some general information when you when you open the box of you know updating. You have to be on iOS 14.5, I believe, or you know later. I think I mean, it might be just iOS 14 in general, um, but I I really think it's 14.5 because that's when they introduced the the stuff the software to be compatible with this. So, yeah, like I said, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'll kind of play around with it. We might do a, a video on, on, you know, if you lose an item or something, just to kind of give you guys some content, because I know I've been kind of uh, MIA for the past uh, little bit since I've, uh, you know, unboxed my, my office chair I'm sitting in right now. I still have to do a, a follow-up video to that. Um, also, I'm looking at getting some better camera equipment and some, uh, you know, mountings so I can maybe do some different shots. Um, well, that might take some time because obviously I have to buy it myself. But uh, yeah, if you like this video, like the content on my channel, uh, be sure to like and subscribe and uh, check back for more videos. We'll catch you next time.